guys thank you so much for coming on my channel today again in this video today i'm going to be talking about things you need to know before you get into a relationship most of us make decisions to get into a relationship for the wrong reasons that will not help us i'm talking about a relationship as in if you want to be in a courtship for the long run you want to get married to this person okay this is very important this is why i want to bring this video out i've been a youth this is very important for me for the youth to listen very carefully because everything starts from your youth okay and I know how hard it is to be in this position so please take time and then study this video and do the right thing for your life first thing first I'm gonna start with know God know God in your life know who God is and the reason why I always say know God is because he can't do nothing nothing on this planet earth and beyond it whatever you want to talk about you can't do nothing without him okay and that's the reason why I always say know God in all my videos I have a personal relationship with him Okay, that's very important. The next thing I'm going to be talking about is know your worth. Know who you are as yourself before you get yourself into a relationship. Know how to handle yourself. Know how to talk to God. Know how to talk to people. Know your weaknesses. Know the advantages and the disadvantages in your life. Know who you are first because you're going to bring another person and you're going to have to study that person for the rest of your life. Okay, so please know who you are. And if you know who you are at the same time, you will know who to bring around you. It's just about staying focused, okay? If you know who you are, you will know how to let people treat you. You will know if you are being treated right or being treated wrong, okay? So this is very, very, very important. The next thing I'm gonna talk about is love, okay? You need to know what love means. Know how to love yourself before you can love someone else. Life is not just about living just like that. You need to understand what love means before you can actually share it to someone for them to feel it feel what you are talking about if you can't love yourself you can't love anyone else and this is why you have to study who you are as i said in the other point i made so take time and then study this point please it's very important the next thing i'm going to talk about is be god fearing knowing god is not just it okay you have to fear him you have to fear your master you have to know that he is the god of all you need to follow his rules his instructions everything that he's asking you to do what do i mean by that love your neighbors as you love yourself okay and that's why i spoke in the and know what love means okay so when you are god fearing you will know how to treat other people you will do the right things for the right reasons you won't jump into conclusions just for your own benefit or your own sake be god fearing and you will treat people right and you will know how to deal with the people you love it all starts from home when you do it right from home you will do it right when you get bigger out there Okay. Now, the next thing I'm going to talk about is what is relationship? What does it mean to you? To me, relationship is selflessness. It's not about you anymore. Before, you used to think about just you. But now, it's not going to be about you anymore. And it's going to get bigger as a family. Relationship is selflessness. You love, you care, and you respect. When you have all this, then God will put a God-fearing person across your way. Let me tell you, every one of us have our better halves. If you're married already, that's yours. If it's not yours, this is the reason why I'm touching on this topic. We don't have to struggle. We have to help each other through the struggles and the experiences that we get from these struggles and it help the younger ones growing or even the older ones who want to change but they don't know how to do it. Okay, so we need to know how to follow these instructions. You need to know all these things before you decide or even think before you get yourself into a relationship. I mean, if you want to be in a courtship and get married to this person, okay, this is very, 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 very important. Don't take it for granted. The next thing I'm going to talk about is knowing what your responsibilities are, okay? When you know what your responsibilities are, your relationship will be a lot easier for you. When you know what your responsibilities are, then you won't be fighting with your partner when they're telling you to do what you're supposed to be doing in the first place. So this is why this is very, very, very important to know what your responsibilities are before you get into relationship. Please, knowing what your goals are in life. You need to know this to know who to connect yourself with, okay? If you don't know this, this is why a lot of us crash. This is what breaks a lot of relationship. You need to come in terms, you need to talk together, okay? It's agreement, it's love, so you need to come together so that each of you can actually follow your dreams and paths at the same time but in being together at the same time. Don't take any of these steps or any of these topics that I raised 
for granted. We are all victims of it and we want to stop it. Please, let's do it right. The next point I'm making is to know what family your partner is coming from. Their religion, their belief, their culture, the way they grew up, and the way they see things in the world, if that's how you see it as well. Okay? You need to make sure you take these boxes before you decide. This will actually be one of the biggest problems for you in your relationship because family is actually one of the big things in this world that you have to take care of. The last point I'm going to make, it's better to stay on your own if you can't take all these boxes or if you can't give it your 100%. One step in, one step out. I'm going to try and see. You better not try at all because you will not give everything that you're supposed to give, all the energy, all the love, all the care that you're supposed to give to let this relationship grow. You will not give it. You will listen to outsiders. You will look at other people's relationships and compare it with yours. God bless you. Thank you for watching and stay blessed. And if you have any topic you want me to cover, please leave it in the comments. I'll look into it and I'll take my time and I'll bring it out for you. Stay safe. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.